Let's start with a surprising breakthrough in inter-Korean ties. The two Koreas have finally agreed on a wage hike for North Korean workers at their joint industrial complex in Kaesong. The deal comes despite strained tensions between them after a landmine blast in the DMZ. Our Kim hyun bin starts us off. After months of wrangling, the two Koreas have finally reached an agreement to increase the wage of North Korean workers at the Kaesong Industrial Complex in North Korea. Sources close to the matter said on Monday that the two sides decided to raise the minimum wage by 5 percent to a little less than 74 U.S. dollars, the same level the wage has been set every year. A unification ministry official says the move is expected to support the stable supply of labor and improve business conditions at the complex. North Korea wanted wages increased by just under 5.2 percent for its 56,000 workers at the complex. The sources say the two sides will also hold a joint committee meeting to discuss how to revise labor guidelines and stress the importance of the consultations by citing its integral role in the wage hike agreement. The agreement was reached amid recently heightened military tensions on the border, where several landmine explosions have been blamed on the north. Pyongyang has denied any part in the blast, refusing to apologize for the two South Korean cadets that were severely injured by the blast. The Kaesong complex, which opened in 2004, is the last remaining vestige of the inter-Korean cooperation and a source of much-needed revenue for the North Korean regime. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.